<laughs> I found the the motherhood and the sort of domestic violence themes the most um, upsetting, and that was to me like the the emotional core of of, of her journey. This element of control and imposing this order is sort of the theme that I thought was because was creepy and, and, and interesting and and I connected to in the film. Girls, boys, kids growing up. I mean, I didn't I didn't play with dolls that much when I was younger, but I did. You know, cousins and stuff had them, and I I played with dolls at their house and everything. And I just remember. It has as much life force as you give it, and that's what happens for me and what happened for me in this film was I believed that he was real and it gave me an environment that I could sort of control and that, Gre that Greta in the movie can control. But I think that, you know, they are made in our likeness and it's sort of taken for granted that they'll, they'll never do anything with all the information they have of like being in your life and being witness to you and when you're, naked or when you're in your kitchen or when you're talking to yourself or whatever it is. Um, so the idea that that, can, that trust is violated is another part that's just sort of, you know, just creepy. There's definitely a, a, a scar there for Greta. Um, and so, you know, she wants to, she wants to play house and she wants to play mother to this doll, however strange that is. And there are, there are a lot of instances of this actually. It was funny in, exploring even when we were looking for the doll to have in the film um mm -hmm. there are a lot of websites that sell children dolls and that's a lot of the time is it's people who have lost children do look for a for coping mechanisms and this is a much bigger topic than we could get into on on the skype chat but it's it's yeah. it's not so strange when you when you really when you really think about what people have gone through. And so, yeah, there was that. There's, there's a lot of stuff that's touched on in this that um, in the midst of this big, you know, horror flick, basically. Mm -hmm.